Greens, you're going to be the passing team. So all you've got to do is worry about getting the ball, high tempo, different angles, movement off the ball to receive. Orange is your dribblers. All I want you to do is exactly what you've just been doing. Get your little scissors, whatever you want to do, your little tricks. But you're trying to get in the way of the greens. You're trying to close the greens down. So if I'm closing Joel down now, what that has a knock-on effect to you, Jack. Good. So you're going to have to keep moving the ball. Off you go. Good. Yes, we're going to play with the magic T word, which is... But are we going to rush it? Good. Ready? Play. Have a look at your surroundings, Alfie. Better greens, well done. Much better. Can we put them under a bit more pressure, oranges? Well done, Joel. Good, freeze, relax. For me at the moment, too many times we're receiving the ball, Alf. And we're turning, and we're turning into what? Into trouble. Get your head up, if you're unsure. Where does it need to go? Just come back again. I've got the pitcher in front of me, then it might be over there to Alfie. Yes? A little bit more energy off this passing team. Come on, let's go, play. Good, better. Charlie, have a look. Good dribblers, can we keep dribbling? What tricks have we got? Much better, Green. Starting to move the ball, getting your head up, knowing what's around you. How do you know what's around you? Before the ball comes or when the ball comes? Before. Know your surroundings, paint the picture, know what you could do. It might be that you've got to turn out. I'll set your little challenge now. Can we try and play off two touches? If you need to take three, take three, but can you really move them so when they're going to come press, press, press? Before you know, it's just that little pass away and you've taken all of them out of the game. Let's keep it in the square if we can. Keep it alive. And relax. A, we're rushing it. Don't forget that they've got a ball at their feet. And B, for me, we're not coming off at angles. There's no movement off the ball. Clever, Dan Jones. If I'm on the passing team and Alfie's got the ball, what's it important for me to do if I'm on this team? Angles off the ball. Angles to receive, movement off the football. Very important because we found out that if we don't move off the ball and we don't react, then we cause this young man problems if he's on the football and, and it gets crowded in. But we also found out in that little session, didn't we, that if you play off one touch, what happens? They swarm, they, they come to you, don't they? And, and that clever player that plays off the one touch, if it's on, it might not be on. But if it's on, then we relieve the pressure.